today, um, can't really do too much with the motor, waiting on parts. Um, yeah, so right there's the manifold. In the meantime, I'm going to work on these brake calipers because I'm not a big fan. I mean, they're somewhat, you know, goldish, but um, I'm going to repaint them. Um, I don't think many of you know, but I used to have a Skyline and I painted them with the same VHT gold high temp paint. Got it over here on the uh, old bench. But this uh, this gold VHT high temp paint is the color I like. Um, it's like a darkish. I don't know if you can tell right there on the uh, on the. Um, but um, that's the kind of gold I like. So I'm gonna be cleaning cleaning them up and uh, making them look. Actually, um, 300ZX brakes, uh, Z32s. They're they're a common upgrade for the uh, S14. Most people that watch 240SX videos kind of know that. So, what I'm going to be doing right now first is cleaning it with some awesome orange, just some regular degreaser from the dollar store, um, and a toothbrush. giving it a scrub down and degreasing it and that's pretty much it then I'll, uh, I'll probably just bag it with a regular trash bag and spray it dried pretty much already so I'm gonna give it a second coat and go from there <laughs>
got this red paint a little bit. It's kind of thick. And let's see how it, how it turns out. Turns out good. Never done this before. not bad for my first try I mean it's just the brakes it's not like anybody's gonna be like zooming in that close but I mean it doesn't look bad holy cow looking out on the camera holy cow it looks good I mean if you zoom up super close you can see I messed the part down the ass and and whatnot but man look at that looks good sweet and then you just pull all this off oh man I just ripped the bag Guess you gotta be a little more tender with it. Yeah. Looking good, man. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I got some paint right there on the wheel. Or the wheel, the uh, rotor. But that's alright when you when you go to stop, it'll just burn it all off. But yeah, looks good. I'm actually a lot happier than I expected it to be with looking at it through the camera. Woo! Almost looks like Brembo's. <laughs> sweet, sweet. Now we just gotta go to the other side and uh... All right. Now we're on the other side. Uh, I'm just gonna be cleaning it off also. And then we'll get the spray. Second coat, you always want to heat up your bottle paint if you're doing this in the cold. Um, as you saw the first time. The reason you heat it up is so that it's about 90 degrees or so of the paint. You don't want to spray it with cold paint for the reason that uh, the paint and the actual solvents inside the can, uh, when they're cold, they tend to separate. So, yeah, warm it up. If you can and a bucket of water, I just use the torch and then shake it up really good. That's of course during the winter. Um, if you're in the summer, you shouldn't have any problem.
feel like it came out too good on this one. Is what it is. It's all finished now. Both sides are done. And I'm happy with it. Got my little paint right there. That's what I think. Looks way better than they did before. And that's all that matters. <laughs>